Hey guys, I'm back with another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to download Plutonium for Modern Warfare 3. First thing you're going to want to do is make sure you have Modern Warfare 3 downloaded, of course, which if you're watching this video, you probably already have it downloaded. Next, go into your library on uh, Steam. Go to this all button right here and make sure tools are selected and then scroll down until you find the Modern Warfare 3 dedicated server. It should be right here with the regular game and the multiplayer should be in between them. And then you're going to want to download this. Now it should download fairly quickly. After you download the server, you're going to want to go right here to uh, this link that I have in the description, which is the uh, plutonium exe file. After you download the file is take it and drag it and put it on your desktop. I already have it on my desktop, so I'm not going to put it on my desktop, but this will be the, uh, lo the thing that you load plutonium with. So I would make sure to put it on your desktop. But after you open it up, it's going to show this a blue window right here. Click more info and run anyways. And then it'll run like this and it'll pull up this window right here. Um, and this window right here, it'll tell you to create an account and go to this website. I will also link this website to in the description. Just create you an account, username, it might ask for your email and a password. And then right after you do that, you just log into Plutonium. And after you log into Plutonium, this is gonna, it's gonna pull up right here. And it'll, it won't say play, it'll say set path or something like that. You're gonna wanna find your Modern Warfare 3 directory. Um, now I'll show you mine just for an example. It might be different for some people, but mine's on this PC, it's in this E drive. And then it should be in Steam Library, Steam Apps, Common, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, and then this should be the, the path right here. So when I ask you to uh, select the path, and once you you select Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, and I'll just show you right here. See, I have E Drive, Steam <clears throat> Library, Steam Apps, Common, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. After you select that folder, it should pull up play, and you should be able to play it. But there's one more thing that I wanna do. Um, if you would like the bots, the bots are very, very good in this game. And I prefer to play with the bots a lot other than joining random servers. So you can create custom games and stuff. I'll have a link in the description for the bots. You're going to want to click right here on the middle right corner, the V2.1.0, and then click on the zip file and download it. After you download it, I would extract it to your, I would extract it to your desktop and it'll have these files right here in them. And then all you're going to want to do is open the install.bat uh, and it'll say one file copied and it should copy it to the plutonium game. So then you should have bots. But if you would also like to edit the bots names because they start off with just in alphabetical order, A, B, C, D. OK, so make sure your game is closed. And then at the bottom down here in the Windows search bar, type in percent local app data percent and it'll pull up this folder right here. Open that folder, go down to plutonium storage IW5, and then down here where the Z underscore SVR underscore bots dot IWD is, right click on it and then click open with, open it with WinRAR. And when you open it with WinRAR, it will pull up all this and then you'll see bot text and then open bot dot text. And you can change the name of the bots right here. So there should be 18 of them. So you change A to like a random name, then like I'll just do like my name. That will be what the name of that bot is. Um, but other than that, that should be about it. I hope this helped you guys. Uh, if it did, don't forget to like and subscribe for more and I'll see you guys next time.